Come on, let's get down there. Don't forget to grab that rifle from your horse. You boys be ready to pick them off from up there. <laughs> sure thing. Good. Come on, let's go. Seems easiest to take the same path down as Bill and Micah. Like you said, revenge is a luxury we can't afford. Yeah, just wasn't sure you agreed with me. Arthur. Arthur, have you completely lost faith in me? Our needs right now are supplies, equipment, and a way out of here. Everything else, including Comb, can wait. Okay. There's enough of those bastards down there to deal with as it is. Now, come on. Watch out. This bit's steep. Maybe I should take the lead on this. They're going to be gunning for you. They ain't got me yet. No, but the way our luck's been running... Hush. Let's just get down there first. Follow me. Let's head for that building in front. this if you want. Left him in the dirt and walked away. Yes, sir, I was touching by Yeah, saw him with my own two eyes. We have to move on this right now. So why did they let you go? So I wouldn't have done. Better didn't have much choice was picking his teeth off the floor. And you didn't tell him nothing. Not a word. What the hell are you doing? Ah, damn it. Ah, all right, boys. Kill these sons of bitches. Kill every last one of these bastards. Push up. There's one up on the water tower.
So, what are we doing, Dutch? I can take this if you want. Just... What the hell are you doing? God damn it! All right, boys! Ah! Kill these sons of bitches! doesn't give a damn about his men. All he cares about is numbers. If you can shoot a gun, ride a horse, and kill without thought, you're in. Think how long some of you have been with me. I imagine Colm doesn't even know half the names of these fools. Heads up, boys! We got more coming in from the forest! Okay, let's wait for Javier and Lenny. 
They're coming down with the horses. Keep an eye out for any more of the bastards. Good work, boys. Now, let's tear this place apart. <clears throat> Bill, you go search. From there. Mike, search that building. Arthur, you take that building to the left. All right, man, quick. Find those detonators, explosives, anything you can. Let's go. Here. This looks good. What do you think, Bill? Well, looks fine. <laughs> Smells good. Come on. Did we get everything? Think so, boss. Found this on one of them. Thank you. This is perfect. Oh, yeah. Interesting. This is something about the train they was gonna rob. A Mr. Leviticus Cornwall. Mount back up. Let's keep moving. All right, let's get out of here. Proud of you boys. All of you. Not a man down. Good work, fellas. Not bad for some starving down and outs. They can pummel us hard as they like. But we will always get back up and fight. That's who we are. Outlaws for life, fellas. Wait until we have John, Mac, Charles, and Sean back riding with us, and I believe, I know, they will all be back. Well, you didn't get combed, but this head will hurt him a lot more than any bullet in the head. Especially when we rob this train, too. <laughs> yeah, I guess we'll see about that. Oh, indeed we will. You know... He'll come after us. Oh, of course he will, just like all the rest. But we're gonna stay a step ahead of them. Make sure we always know where they are before they know where we are. We allowed ourselves to get a step behind in Blackwater. That won't happen again. Ha! Hold. All right, dig in, fellas. Let's make some ground. This is... Uh, they got me mixed up with someone else! I'm no use to you, really! What's your name, boy? I don't know. You don't know your name? It's Karen. Karen what? Duffy, Kieran Duffy. Well, 
I ain't gonna lie to you. This is a real bad day for you, Kieran Duffy. Where are you taking me? Somewhere you ain't gonna like. Why? What are you gonna do to me? Some friend you ain't gonna like. So I'd advise you to save your breath for screaming. No, please! your mouth, you little shitter. I will shut it for you. Shit. Let's introduce you to the boys. Don't hurt me, please. Oh, don't worry. They're real nice. Huh. You found a little shit, did you? Yep. <laughs> I got them. Very good. Welcome to your new home. Hope you're real happy here. <sighs> you want me to make him talk? Oh, no, now all we'll get is lies. Uncle, Mr. Williamson, tie this maggot up someplace safe. We get him hungry first. I got a saying, my friend. We shoot fellas as need shooting, save fellas as need saving, and feed them as need feeding. We are gonna find out what you need. I can't believe it! An O'Driscoll in my camp. No, I ain't an O'Driscoll, mister. I, I hate that fella. Oh, whatever you say, son. Well done, Arthur. I'm just sorry we missed out on Cole. Oh, there's time enough for that. Now, I gotta figure out if we can hit that train. Okay. Been a bad few weeks, but Dutch being Dutch, he is busy making plans, and Dutch being Dutch, those plans involve robbery and dreams. Well, I thought you was reading him his last rites. Now I see you're introducing him to your... so kindly provided to us by the O'Driscoll. The train will be coming north from Big Valley. We're gonna pick it off after it crosses the border into the Grizzlies. There's a raised spot there that should give us good vantage. Charles, you'll keep lookout for any outriders. How's that hand, by the way?